Hi everyone, um, this is Anu again from Indian Makeup Diva and welcome to my second YouTube tutorial. It has been long in the making, um, but I've been a little bit sick. I have the world's worst sinus headache. It's like here and it just will not go away. Um, long story short, I've been miserable. <laughs> And also, um, it's been a little bit tough with the lighting, so I hope I'm improving. I'm trying to keep everything closer. Um, so, anyways, that is that. That is my status update. And I will start with the second one, a uh, second tutorial. And I've done this before, but I just wanted to do a um, video tutorial on this because some people thought it was a little confusing. And I'm sure it was because it's a little complicated looking at pictures rather than someone actually showing you and it's um, going to be on threading. I don't recommend trying to thread your eyebrows yourself. I've heard of people doing it but um, I'm not convinced. <laughs> it's humanly possible to do that for yourself. If it is then I apologize but uh, I'm not convinced. And um, But it is great for upkeep of your upper lip which I always do. So what you will need is yourself and perhaps a little bit of hair and um, I have this 100% polyester thread and I know there's um, threading thread available but and this works just fine. Some of the other ones though they don't have as much um, they're not as strong but I find that this one works just fine. Um, so you need around this much, something where you can fit both your hands in comfortably, so you kind of make a loop, or not a loop, but just like that. And um, I think this is a comfortable um, amount. So I'm just going to cut this off here. And I'm going to tie the ends. Like so. And this is so because you cannot hold it in your mouth or anything like that. And if you've ever seen someone do threading, they hold one end in their mouth and the other one like that. But I don't know if you could see that. Um, and they just go ahead and thread. But um, since you don't, you can't, you don't have the, I don't have the ability to do that, I just do that. So you take the thread like this, it's about this big. And I find that a very comfortable um, range. If it's a little bit bigger, it gets hard for me to really exact a lot of pressure. If it's small, my hands are big and I'm not able to um, really get much control either. So you twist it on one end, like this, five, six times, and you kind of move it to the center. So the motion you're going to be making is um, just this motion. And as soon as you do that, you just open up this um, hand again, and the twists, or curls, or whatever, um, will go to the other side and you can just do that again. So basically your skin is going to be here, like um, right before those loops, and um, when you do this it's going to pick up the hairs and pull them out. And um, when you do it on your upper lip, some people like to push their tongue up to um, like this part under under from underneath, like this. <laughs> charming but it it really works and so what you're going to do is just make this motion what and you're going to f <laughs> you will know when you're pulling out um, the hairs I at least I feel it so I'm just going to show you uh, not going to be able to talk very well so here we go make the motion So as soon as you get here, you just push it back and you touch it back on your skin and, um, and then you start 
the process again. And as you move up, you can go here. And depending on which side um, it is, you're going to have to change um, the direction in which you pull. So on this side, um, the skin is over here, and you push the loops this way. And on this side, um, the skin is right here, um, to the right of the loops, and um, you push the loops this way, and it'll pull out the hairs from there. Um, you can if you really want. I do this when I'm desperate. Um, you know, use it to just clean up a little bit here on top of your eyebrows. Don't really touch um, the eyebrow itself, but just like a few stray hairs that come up here, which my threader usually takes out. Um, I do do those. It gets harder on this side because I'm right-handed. And, you know, you can do this area too with it. Um, just, you know, this and this is a little bit hard, but every other area, it's not too bad. And um, if you can reach, you can just thread away. <laughs> and that um, is as simple as it is. I hope you like this tutorial. I thought it would be a little bit useful considering pictures are a little bit um, confusing. So thank you very much for watching and I hope you liked it. And do let me know what you think. I um, promise I'll be a little bit more consistent with my tutorials. I'm just, my sinus is just killing me. Thank you.